Welcome back. A Juneteenth celebrations are reaching a peak around the country ahead of tomorrow's holiday. Since last week, cities around mid Michigan have been hosting special events to mark Juneteenth, and tonight's celebration brought music to Eaton County. Josh Sanchez has more on how collaboration between local municipalities is an example of the holiday's unity. Jazz music filled Sharp Park in Delta Township tonight, bringing families together and feet moving. Delta Township trustee Fonda Brewer says the week of Juneteenth events are part of a now two-year collaboration with nearby communities in East Lansing, Meridian Township, Michigan State University, and Lansing. That has led to two weeks of festivity in mid-Michigan, marking a pivotal point in American history. It's so important when we talk about our black history, everyone's history, and the independence of black people, and so that's why we're we're here. We're here to honor that and celebrate that beautiful holiday. While Juneteenth became a federal holiday in 2021, only 29 states in the District of Columbia observed the holiday as a permanent paid state and or legal holiday. Michigan joined the ranks last year. The holiday has been expanding since 1865 when on June 19, enslaved African Americans in Galveston Bay, Texas, were declared free by U.S. Army forces two years after the Emancipation Proclamation abolished slavery. Brewer says the expansion at the community and national level is an example of how Juneteenth has a place in the story of America. Everybody getting together with different walks of life. It doesn't matter if you're black, brown, orange, yellow, or blue. Everybody pulled together and everybody's celebrating. Here for you in Delta Township, Josh Sanchez, 6 News.